I was waiting to see what this line was, and I absolutely love it. I was afraid of this line for the last two games as they bumped the PRA and then he faced the Clippers. Shame on me for being worried. Smashed the over in both games. We were on this for a couple prior to that, and there's a lot of reasons why. I'm going to dive into those right now. Before we get going, hit the like button if you've been hitting those W's with me as I have been absolutely on fire, 16-3. and three. Let's get paid. Yep, that's right. Jamal Murray is out again, which gives us the green light to hit this over. Now, we are talking a 12-game sample size. Throw away the very first game just because it's fun to play with numbers. And Aaron Gordon has hit the over in 11 straight games on the Denver Nuggets without Jamal Murray. I love this play. He's actually been smashing it at higher numbers as well, but we're getting a little discount here. This line is a minus 111 on FanDuel Sportsbook. For all my sportsbook people out there, you could take it there. I believe Fliff this morning was like a minus 122 for you Fliffer Nutters. He's averaged 34.7 PRA without Jamal Murray, and he's playing a ton of minutes. And on top of that, he hit 33. So if you're worried about him versus Zion Williamson, he hit 33 against the Pelicans earlier this season. People are like, oh, man, he's going to get out rebounded or get into foul trouble. Aaron Gordon, low-key, a very good defender, was a crucial element of the Nuggets' postseason run last year as well. And I don't expect anything to change in this game, and I expect, hopefully, uh, Aaron Gordon to go out there, do what he does best, and that's going to be play good defense, gobble up some rebounds, and score some points. And I think we can get that out of Aaron Gordon. He's also been surprising us with some decently high assist games for Aaron Gordon. I'm going to go ahead and take the over. I love this play. It's probably my favorite play on the day. I posted six plays inside Discord. Let me give you a little sneak peek of what it looked like. There you go. Went full screen for you. You can see it. I got all my notes written down. I give people a little write-up where you can find it, and then I let everybody know, hey, this is available on Prize Picks, Underdog, Sleeper Play, uh, or Parlay Play, Sleeper Picks, Better, Chalkboard. I'm letting everybody know where to get this type of stuff, and then I go ahead and make slips for them after I do all my betting picks on the sports books, and then I posted a Flex 6 already for Prize Picks inside Discord. Grab that link down below. It's $15, just 15 bucks to be a part of the 16-3 and three run. Get access to 10-plus cappers inside my Discord, an odds finder tool, parlay builder tool, betting models, betting research sheets, and soon player prop projections, all going to be a part of your world inside my $15 first month dub club. Play number two, Kyle Kuzma, over 21 and a half points. Yeah, I like this one. Quick little read-up. This line's 22 and a half in every single sports books other than FanDuel right now that also has this line at over 21 and a half for minus 111. I love this play, but I only love it at 21 and a half points. If it bumps to 22 and a half or even 22, my hands are off. I'm washing them. I'm out. When Kuzma has played 25 plus minutes, taken 15 plus field goal attempts, he scored 22 plus points in 67% of his games the last two years, including six of 10 this season. He hooked twice. At 21 and a half, if you were to take the 22 and a half. That's right. He finished at 21 in two of those games. So you got to be very careful with this one. He's also smashed the Knicks. He's been very good against the Knicks, scoring 40, 27, and 23 against Julius Randle's defense on the other side. So I like this play. Washington also at home. They're playing better ball, even though they can't close out basketball games. They are playing better ball. Kuzma, while he has been hitting the under, nothing's changed. Solid minutes. Field goal attempts are up. 10 trips to the free throw line in two of the last three games. He's taking a ton of three-point attempts per game. He just had a few games where he was shooting cold. He looks a lot better for the last three. I expect this one to continue to hit the over against Julius Randle. Good trends in history. The odds are fine, and the line is tremendous, especially when all the other books are at 22.5. So grab it on FanDuel or grab it on Prize Picks. That concludes the premium picks portion of the video. I'm going to the myspray.com odds finder, clicking optimizer. Yes. Highest to lowest probability. And then putting on 250. Then you just start scrolling down and you look for value. John Collins under eight and a half rebounds. Now this is where I'm going to give you a bunch of picks. So focus up under eight and a half rebounds right now on six sports books, totally juiced to the under my word. It's crazy juiced all the way to minus 137 on pinnacle up to minus 145 on fliff still live on underdog. You can grab it on sleeper under eight and a half rebounds. John Collins. This is just the math portion. I am highlighting value for you. I am telling you, look, this gas station over here is $3 per 
you know, gallon of gas and it's $4 over there. Where are you going to go? You're going to go to the $3 place. This is line shopping 101. Harrison Barnes, under one and a half threes available on price picks. Underdog sleeper. We have six sports books, five of them juiced in the under. I think fair, fairly fine option here on DK minus 130 to the under. Keegan Murray available on three books, but give me more than just three. I don't want to line shop and compare prices for just three books there. So I'm going to pass on that one and just keep on moving. Uh, Benchero here under one and a half threes. There's five sports books taking the under, not taking the other, but five books where the line is saying there's a decent probability. In fact, a 58.08% chance that the under hits Valanchunas under half a three. But again, large slate today. Give me something like this instead. Like you could take Valanchunas. Four books are saying uh, the odds are implying, I should say, that 58% chance he hits the under. But wait, I mean, here we are. Give, give me this. Give me Booker. We're six sports books are leaning to the under. All the betters are saying under two and a half threes. That is live on price picks. That is live on underdog. That is live on sleeper. So on and so forth, my friends. You guys have a, oh my goodness. Look at all these options all above the 57 percent marker that i like to use there is so much value this morning you got to use it it's myspari.com yeah if you're on mobile click the three little lines and then boom click the odds finder and you guys can go crazy pause my video if you need help dive into my discord all my dub club members are in there. They're using it. They're talking about their plays. They're sharing their slips. Uh, there's one member last night shared a flex six for price picks, and he fully swept it. And a bunch of members tailed him because they always see this guy hitting. That stuff happens in Discord for the members. We have a private member slips channel where you guys can post them. People in chat talking all day, using the odds finder, finding value for one another, and sharing what they find. It's it's a great community. I want you to get access. It's $15 for your first month. Grab that link down below. And at the very least, hopefully you're banging home W's today. 16-3 and three run. I'm going to try to post some more stuff today, even though I've already posted six and a flex six. It's a huge NBA slate, and NFL props are dropping left and right. So while today's video is not a straight-up here six picks flex 25 option, I did show you a slew of picks using the odds finder, and I gave you two premium picks today to help get you started on this 16 and three run grab the rest inside discord again hit the like button for me you guys have been really running the likes up and dropping comments which have been helping others find this video do it again today let's make money and i'll be back catch me today later on the ragey q channel on youtube catch me later today on the ragey q channel as we are doing some more prize picks and nfl and NBA betting on the Breakfast and Bets show. I'll see you in the inside, my friends. Have yourself a day. Let's go get paid. What up, my friends? Do you want access to a dozen plus cappers, an odds finder tool, and a parlay builder tool for less than 20 bucks? Well, you can have it using promo code STREAM, S-T-R-E-A-M. I'll see you in the inside, my friends. Let's get paid.